Hey, it's Lauren. Today I'm going to be doing a Lush video, so I'm going to be showing you an online order that I picked up recently, well, a few days ago, but I haven't been able to show you because I wasn't here, and then I came back and it was already here, so I haven't been here for about a week because my mum basically got married and I was just I had a hen party, which you might have seen the pictures on Instagram of that Harry Potter hen night party, it was pretty cool, and the wedding and stuff like that. So I was also dog sitting at one point, so it's been pretty busy, so that's why I haven't been as active on YouTube for about a week. So I'm just going to show you what I picked up. So I did pick up two of the scrubbies and these are like a body scrub and a body butter in one and these are like the honey i washed the kids scent and these are now nine pound but i really love the scent of these i picked up the cookie dough body scrub this is another body scrub um i've got a lot of body scrubs now <laughs> I didn't have any and then I was like, let's get more and then now I have too many. So, this is from the Lush Community Favourites. So I picked up a second one, this is my second tub. I haven't finished the other one, I just wanted to pick it up. I really think they should bring this to store because it smells really good. And the texture's unlike any of the other body scrubs that I have. But some people have said that it smells like happy blooming. I don't know what that smells like. But it's a very strong almond scent. And there is vanilla in there as well. And hazelnut and pistachio oil. So it's very nutty, I guess. So I got a second one of them. I think they were £13. But I'm not 100% sure. I did pick up the Super Milk from the Lush Labs. Um, this is my second bottle. And I'm gonna be uploading like a Lush Hair Care collection soon. And this isn't gonna be in it because this arrived after I did the video. So you can basically just add this to that. But it's kind of like a spicy scent like vanilla it's similar to candy rain but not quite the same but I do use it with candy rain and I think it's pretty good which is why I got a second one I have picked up a new soap I've not used this before this is a it's really big um I think it's a cold press soap and it's pretty thick, it's like, thick. <laughs> um, but this is called the Gardener, with a little watering can on there. And I actually saw this on Instagram and I was like, oh my gosh, I would really like that soap. But it has like rosemary, nettle, and other things in there as well. I really like the scent, it smells like familiar. but not necessarily a lush scent but I think this gardener bit is like a moisturising bit of the soap I mean I have found that these are quite drying but I'm kind of tempted to see how this works as a shampoo because I mean I did have the Snow Fairy one from 2017 and I still have it and I'm still using it and it's now in two pieces I really like this scent. I actually think they're discontinuing the yellow one, like Hippie or something. I think that's what it's called. Ooh. You can press the soap a bit. That's weird. The soap's a bit squishy. I thought it would have been harder. Weird. Okay. So I think this was 
more expensive than the normal soaps, but that's because it's going to last a lot longer than the other ones because of the formula. Anyway, it does look like it's kind of not completely rounded. I really like the scent of this. And I'm probably going to try it as a shampoo. So another soap that I picked up is the maple soap and it looks like I got an end piece so there's, only, there's not much green there and I think this smells amazing some people have said that it smells similar to beets shower jelly and I think it does smell very similar but without the charcoal element so I literally got a sample of this and I loved it so much that I bought a bigger one and I think this was 4 50 so it's pretty cheap, um, it's not very thick but it's too big for the sink, I'm gonna have to cut it up. I think it smells really good. So that is the maple soap. Um, the last thing that I got was the intergalactic shower gel which I've been dying to have, literally dying to have. I love, I do like the scent, it's not the same as the maple. It's like a mint and grapefruit, so there is peppermint, grapefruit, mint infusion, vetiver, cedarwood, and no, that's it. And I was really worried that this was going to smell like Aurora Borealis because I don't like that body scrub. It's in it's one of the body scrubs that came out for Lush Labs and it's also coming to store on July the 19th or the 17th, something like that. It's coming out in about a week but and so are all the other things which probably means that everything that they're going to discontinue will not be available anymore on that date, like the 17th or 19th. I don't know but it's on Instagram somewhere but they're going to be bringing all the new shower oils the, what else are they bringing? The lip scrub, new soaps, like the, the four new beetle soaps and then the sleepy soap as well. And just new things basically, which I'm too poor to buy. Right now anyway. But this is, it's different to Aurora Borealis. Because that had mint and it smelled like grapefruit to me, but it actually had pineapple in it or something. But this is like, it's not the same, it's not as strong as the Dirty Spring Wash or the Maple Soap. It's like orangey as well. I think it's really nice. And obviously there is loads and loads of glitter in there. So I'm really excited to try that. I might try that next month because I've already got things out for this month. So that is actually everything because I did not get samples. But I did ask for, as you can see what it says on the top of the box. I did ask for random solid samples and I didn't get any samples. <laughs> so <laughs> I don't know why. Like, I did ask in the description box. And that's why you can put stuff about postage as well. I just didn't get any samples, so maybe they didn't have any solid samples. But that is literally everything for this video. Um I will be uploading some tea videos very soon so thanks for watching